Hello and welcome back to another new quick tip tutorial. Today we I show you how I made this picture. Uh, it's a simple shot um, and I tried to render it foot so photorealistic as possible. And how I did this you will see in a moment. So close this and open up Maya. Here is a simple scene setup. And uh, first we create a light, especially an area light. Bring it out of the room. And bring it in position. This means to be the light from the outside. So Okay, that's the area light and now we have to do some little things. First of all, under shadows, um, activate the ray trace shadows, increase the rays numbers um, while we're rendering with ray tracing. So. Under Mental Ray, click Use Light Shape and turn it on as visible. And under Light Shader, click on that and scroll down and choose this little guy, the Mirror Portal Light. Right, that will do. Part 1, ready. Part 2 is simply go under the render settings choose indirect lightning and under indirect lightning you have this option physical sun and sky and hit create wonderful so now you see a directional light and when you turn it um, you change the position of the sun. I think I choose a uh, midday time and under the Mia Physical Sky you have uh, some available options. I don't change them for this quick tutorial. Um, are these settings okay? So what we need is to check the settings under the render settings. Final gather on, 300 is okay. Quality, it's fine trace, right? Okay, now I set these on 300 quality. So all right, we have that. So. Features, ray tracing, and final gather on. Okay, and under common, I choose for this tutorial a lower resolution. Alright, and when that is done, we go and render the image. And we will see us back soon. So, right, now we had a first view on our picture and still it's a little bit dark, and but we can see some progress and it looks not bad at all. Right, okay, let's change the perspective. And go near. And the sun. 
deeper in the room, in the room. And ta -da, ta -da. the chair. Right. Let's do another quick render and let's see what we get. So, and that's um, our finally render. Not bad, not bad. Still a little bit bludgy, but um, this um, can avoid if you increase the settings of the final gather about five to six hundred. All right. And that's for now, but I will show you another setup, um, what you can also use in a sec. Alright, here we are, and to came this um, picture, uh, it's more like a cartoon. Um, there is another way and it's um, quicker to render and I will show you in short the settings. Um, scrolling back. It's a spotlight that uh, means to be the sun and as you can see here are the settings of the spotlight so right that's nothing and the settings for the area light as you noticed, uh, we have also a mere portal light. Ray trace shadows on seven. So right, and the area light itself. Let me see. No, there aren't some changes here in the render settings, as we have before. Except we had turn off the physical sun and sky, and the difference is now that we have a cheaper version of the picture we had before. All right, um, thank you for watching and. We see us next, and yeah, bye-bye.